Fluoride, Wikipedia Audio Fluoride slash FL RA D slash slash FL RA D slash is an inorganic, monatomic anion of fluorine with the chemical formula F. Fluoride is the simplest anion of fluorine. Its salts and minerals are important chemical reagents and industrial chemicals, mainly used in the production of hydrogen fluoride for fluorocarbons. In terms of charge and size, the fluoride ion resembles the hydroxide ion. Fluoride ions occur on Earth in several minerals, particularly fluorite, but are only present in trace quantities in water. Fluoride contributes a distinctive bitter taste. It contributes no color to fluoride salts. Fluorides include compounds that contain both ionic fluoride and those where fluoride does not dissociate. The nomenclature does not distinguish these situations. For example, sulfur hexafluoride and carbon tetrafluoride are not sources of fluoride ions under ordinary conditions. The systematic name fluoride, the valid IUPAC name, is determined according to the additive nomenclature. However, the name fluoride is also used in compositional IUPAC nomenclature which does not take the nature of bonding involved into account. Fluoride is also used non-systematically, to describe compounds which release fluoride upon dissolving. Hydrogen fluoride is itself an example of a non-systematic name of this nature. However, it is also a trivial name, and the preferred IUPAC name for fluorine. Nomenclature Fluorine is estimated to be the 13th most abundant element in the Earth's crust and is widely dispersed in nature, almost entirely in the form of fluorides. Many minerals are known, but of paramount commercial importance is fluorite, which is roughly 49% fluoride by mass. The soft, colorful mineral is found worldwide. Fluoride is naturally present at low concentration in most fresh and salt water sources and may also be present in rainwater. Seawater fluoride levels are usually in the range of 0.86 to 1.4 mg L, and average 1.1 mg L. For comparison, chloride concentration in seawater is about 19 g L. The low concentration of fluoride reflects the insolubility of the alkaline earth fluorides, e.g., CaF2. In some locations, such as Tanzania, the drinking water contains dangerously high levels of fluoride, leading to serious health problems. Worldwide 50 million people receive water from water supplies that naturally have close to the optimal level. In other locations the level of fluoride is very low, sometimes leading to fluoridation of public water supplies to bring the level to around 0.7 to 1.2 ppm. Concentrations in fresh water vary more significantly. Surface water such as rivers or lakes generally contains between 0.010.3 ppm. Groundwater concentrations vary even more, depending on the presence of local fluoride-containing minerals. For example, natural levels of under 0.05 mg L have been detected in parts of Canada but up to 8 mg L in parts of China, in general levels rarely exceed 10 mg liter. Fluoride can be present in rain with its concentration increasing significantly upon exposure to volcanic activity or atmospheric pollution derived from burning fossil fuels or other sorts of industry. All vegetation contains some fluoride, which is absorbed from soil and water. Some plants concentrate fluoride from their environment more than others. 
All tea leaves contain fluoride, however, mature leaves contain as much as 10 to 20 times the fluoride levels of young leaves from the same plant. Fluoride can act as a base. It can combine with a proton, the conjugate acid of fluoride. Bifluoride used as an etchant for glass, tetrafluoroberylate, hexafluoroplatinate, tetrafluoroborate used in organometallic synthesis, hexafluorophosphate used as an electrolyte in commercial secondary batteries, trifluoromethane sulfonate. In aqueous solution, fluoride has a pKb value of 10.8. It is therefore a weak base, and tends to remain as the fluoride ion rather than generating a substantial amount of hydrogen fluoride. That is, the following equilibrium favors the left-hand side in water. However, upon prolonged contact with moisture, Soluble fluoride salts will decompose to their respective hydroxides or oxides, as the hydrogen fluoride escapes. Fluoride is distinct in this regard among the halides. The identity of the solvent can have a dramatic effect on the equilibrium shifting it to the right-hand side, greatly increasing the rate of decomposition. Occurrence Salts containing fluoride are numerous and adopt myriad structures. Typically the fluoride anion is surrounded by four or six cations, as is typical for other halides. Sodium fluoride and sodium chloride adopt the same structure. For compounds containing more than one fluoride per cation, the structures often deviate from those of the chlorides as illustrated by the main fluoride mineral fluorite where the Ca2 plus ions are surrounded by 8F centers. In CaCl2, each Ca2 plus ion is surrounded by 6Cl centers. Upon treatment with a standard acid, fluoride salts convert to hydrogen fluoride and metal salts. With strong acids, it can be doubly protonate to give H, 2F+. Oxidation of fluoride gives fluorine. Solutions of inorganic fluorides in water contain F, and bifluoride HF, 2. Few inorganic fluorides are soluble in water without undergoing significant hydrolysis. In terms of its reactivity, Fluoride differs significantly from chloride and other halides, and is more strongly solvated in protic solvents due to its smaller radius-slash-charge ratio. Its closest chemical relative is hydroxide. When relatively unsolvated, for example in non-protic solvents, fluoride anions are called naked. Naked fluoride is a very strong Lewis base, it is easily reacted with Lewis acids, forming strong adducts. Fluoride is susceptible to extreme ultraviolet radiation, ejecting an electron to become highly reactive atomic fluorine. It has a standard electrode potential of 2.87 volts. At physiological pHs, hydrogen fluoride is usually fully ionized to fluoride. In biochemistry, fluoride and hydrogen fluoride are equivalent. Fluorine, in the form of fluoride, is considered to be a micronutrient for human health, necessary to prevent dental cavities, and to promote healthy bone growth. The tea plant is a known accumulator of fluorine compounds, released upon forming infusions such as the common beverage. The fluorine compounds decompose into products including fluoride ions. Fluoride is the most bioavailable form of fluorine, and as such, tea is potentially a vehicle for fluoride dosing. Approximately, 50% of absorbed fluoride is excreted renally with a 24-hour period. The remainder can be retained in the oral cavity, and lower digestive tract. 
fasting dramatically increases the rate of fluoride absorption to near 100%, from a 60% to 80% when taken with food. Per a 2013 study, it was found that consumption of 1 liter of tea a day, can potentially supply the daily recommended intake of 4 mg per day. Some lower quality brands can supply up to a 120% of this amount. Fasting can increase this to 150%. The study indicates that tea drinking communities are at an increased risk of dental and skeletal fluorosis, in the case where water fluoridation is in effect. Fluoride ion in low doses in the mouth reduces tooth decay. For this reason, it is used in toothpaste and water fluoridation. At much higher doses and frequent exposure, fluoride causes health complications and can be toxic. Fluoride salts and hydrofluoric acid are the main fluorides of industrial value. Compounds with CF bonds fall into the realm of organofluorine chemistry. The main uses of fluoride, in terms of volume, are in the production of cryolite, na 3 alf 6 It is used in aluminium smelting. Formerly, it was mined, but now it is derived from hydrogen fluoride. Fluorite is used on a large scale to separate slag in steel making. Mined fluorite is a commodity chemical used in steel making. Hydrofluoric acid and its anhydrous form, hydrogen fluoride, is also used in the production of fluorocarbons. Hydrofluoric acid has a variety of specialized applications, including its ability to dissolve glass. Fluoride-containing compounds, such as sodium fluoride or sodium monofluorophosphate are used in topical and systemic fluoride therapy for preventing tooth decay. They are used for water fluoridation and in many products associated with oral hygiene. Originally, sodium fluoride was used to fluoridate water. Hexafluorosilicic acid and its salt sodium hexafluorosilicate are more commonly used additives, especially in the United States. The fluoridation of water is known to prevent tooth decay and is considered by the U.S. Centers for Disease Control and Prevention as one of ten great public health achievements of the 20th century. In some countries where large, centralized water systems are uncommon, Fluoride is delivered to the populace by fluoridating table salt. For the method of action for cavity prevention, see fluoride therapy. Fluoridation of water has its critics. Fluoridated toothpaste is in common use, but is only effective at concentrations above 1000 ppm, as common in North America and Europe. Fluoride salts are commonly used in biological assay processing to inhibit the activity of phosphatases, such as serine-3-anine phosphatases. Fluoride mimics the nucleophilic hydroxide ion in these enzymes' active sites. Beryllium fluoride and aluminium fluoride are also used as phosphatase inhibitors since these compounds are structural mimics of the phosphate group and can act as analogs of the transition state of the reaction. Chemical Properties Basicity The U.S. Institute of Medicine updated estimated average requirements and recommended dietary allowances for some minerals in 1997 where there was not sufficient information to establish ears and RDAs, an estimate designated adequate intake was used instead. ACE are typically matched to actual average consumption, with the assumption that there appears to be a need, and that need is met by what people consume. The current AI for women 19 years and older is 3.0 mg slash day. The AI for men is 4.0 mg slash day. 
The AI for children ages 1 to 18 increases from 0.7 to 3.0 mg slash day. The major known risk of fluoride deficiency appears to be an increased risk of bacteria-caused tooth cavities. As for safety, the IOM sets tolerable upper intake levels for vitamins and minerals when evidence is sufficient. In the case of fluoride the UL is 10 mg slash day. Collectively the ears, RDAs, ACE, and ULs are referred to as dietary reference intakes. Structure of fluoride salts Inorganic chemistry Biochemistry Applications Cavity prevention The European Food Safety Authority refers to the collective set of information as dietary reference values, with population reference intake instead of RDA, and average requirement instead of ear. AI and UL defined the same as in United States. For women ages 18 and older the AI is set at 2.9 mg slash day. For men the value is 3.4 mg slash day. For children ages 1 17 years the ACE increase with age from 0.6 to 3.2 mg slash day. These ACE are comparable to the US ACE. The EFSA reviewed safety evidence and set an adult UL at 7.0 mg slash day. For U.S. food and dietary supplement labeling purposes the amount of a vitamin or mineral in a serving is expressed as a percent of daily value. Although there is information to set adequate intake, fluoride does not have a daily value and is not required to be shown on food labels. Daily intakes of fluoride can vary significantly according to the various sources of exposure. Values ranging from 0.46 to 3.65.4 mg slash day have been reported in several studies. In areas where water is fluoridated this can be expected to be a significant source of fluoride, however fluoride is also naturally present in a huge range of foods in a wide range of concentrations. The maximum safe daily consumption of fluoride is 10 mg slash day for an adult or 7 mg slash day. Biochemical reagent The upper limit of fluoride intake from all sources is set at 0.10 mg slash kg slash day for infants, toddlers, and children through to 8 years old. For older children and adults, who are no longer at risk for dental fluorosis, the upper limit of fluoride is set at 10 mg slash day regardless of weight. Data taken from United States Department of Agriculture, National Nutrient Database According to the U.S. Department of Agriculture, the dietary reference intakes, which is the highest level of daily nutrient intake that is likely to pose no risk of adverse health effects specify 10 mg slash day for most people, corresponding to 10 L of fluoridated water with no risk. For infants and young children the values are smaller, ranging from 0.7 mg slash d for infants to 2.2 mg slash d. Water and food sources of fluoride include community water fluoridation, seafood, tea, and gelatin. Soluble fluoride salts, of which sodium fluoride is the most common, are toxic and have resulted in both accidental and self-inflicted deaths from acute poisoning. The lethal dose for most adult humans is estimated at 5 to 10 grams. A case of a fatal poisoning of an adult with 4 grams of sodium fluoride is documented, and a dose of 120 grams sodium fluoride has been survived. For sodium fluorosilicate, the median lethal dose orally in rats is 0.125 g slash kg, corresponding to 12.5 grams for a 100 kg adult. The fatal period ranges from 5 minutes to 12 hours.
The mechanism of toxicity involves the combination of the fluoride anion with the calcium ions in the blood to form insoluble calcium fluoride, resulting in hypocalcemia. Calcium is indispensable for the function of the nervous system, and the condition can be fatal. Treatment may involve oral administration of dilute calcium hydroxide or calcium chloride to prevent further absorption, and injection of calcium gluconate to increase the calcium levels in the blood. Hydrogen fluoride is more dangerous than salts such as NAF because it is corrosive and volatile, and can result in fatal exposure through inhalation or upon contact with the skin. Calcium gluconate gel is the usual antidote. In the higher doses used to treat osteoporosis, sodium fluoride can cause pain in the legs and incomplete stress fractures when the doses are too high, it also irritates the stomach, sometimes so severely as to cause ulcers. Slow release and enteric coated versions of sodium fluoride do not have gastric side effects in any significant way, and have milder and less frequent complications in the bones. In the lower doses used for water fluoridation, the only clear adverse effect is dental fluorosis, which can alter the appearance of children's teeth during tooth development. This is mostly mild and is unlikely to represent any real effect on aesthetic appearance or on public health. Fluoride was known to enhance the measurement of bone mineral density at the lumbar spine, but it was not effective for vertebral fractures and provoked more non-vertebral fractures. Dietary Recommendations a popular urban myth claims that the Nazis used fluoride in concentration camps, but there is no historical evidence to prove this claim. In areas that have naturally occurring high levels of fluoride in groundwater which is used for drinking water, both dental and skeletal fluorosis can be prevalent and severe. Estimated Daily Intake Around one-third of the human population drinks water from groundwater resources. Of this, about 10%, approximately 300 million people, obtains water from groundwater resources that are heavily contaminated with arsenic or fluoride. These trace elements derive mainly from minerals. Maps are available of locations of potential problematic wells. Concentrated fluoride solutions are corrosive. Gloves made of nitrile rubber are worn when handling fluoride compounds. The hazards of solutions of fluoride salts depend on the concentration. In the presence of strong acids, fluoride salts release hydrogen fluoride, which is corrosive, especially toward glass. Safety Ingestion Hazard maps for fluoride in groundwater Organic and inorganic anions are produced from fluoride, including Topical Other derivatives <laughs>